Robin Brown and Cody Brown have been the two cast members that have had the most difficulties. During the last few seasons of Sister Wives, they have been attempting to salvage their failing marriage, while the other leads have left the multiple family and found peace. Their lives have changed significantly. As a result, one was selling their home in Flagstaff. A lot of people started to question whether Cody and Robin intended to leave Flagstaff. However, that was untrue rumor. Had it that the couple ultimately found a larger, more opulent home to call home. But in Arizona, finally, it has been confirmed whether or not the pair actually carried out this move. Have they moved into a new home at last Cody? And Robin's sister wives listed their flagstaff, home for sale for $1.6 million. Fans were aware that Robin and Cody were no longer on good terms. The most of it was related to the problems. They started having following the family's breakup. Things started to become worse. One sister wives viewers realized how simple it was for the polygamist to place. The blame for everything on his favorite wife, who was the only one still by his side. At that point, there was news that the couple was selling their home in Flagstaff. In 2019, Cody and Robin paid $890,000 for the house in 2024. However, they chose to sell it for $1.6 million. Many started to believe that their financial situation was the reason for their decision. However, the audience is, well, aware of their addiction to purchasing all things ostentatious and extravagant. At that point, there was a speculation that the couple might have spent $4 million on a considerably larger home in Flagstaff. Is this accurate, sister wives? Did Cody and Robin discover a $4 million new home? As previously said, there are more rumors than ever before the sister wives fandom was initially taken aback when Cody and Robin announced their intention to sell their five-person family, home years. However, according to the most recent confirmation, this is not the case. Soon after there was another rumor that the couple had purchased the luxurious $4 million estate in Flagstaff that had eight bedrooms and eight bathrooms. According to the records found online and the documents acquired, the property was bought last month by a family unrelated to the Browns in September 2024. It took place, this implies that Robin and Cody may still be looking for a new residence. It's likely that they will also leave Flagstaff. Their old house is still for sale and has not been sold fans. Don't really know what's been happening in Cody and Robin's lives because they don't post on social media. Additionally, although the TV shows they are watching are brand new, the crew taped them more than a year ago to find out what has been going on with their intentions to move in. Viewers will have to wait for additional stories. Recently, there have been rumors that Cody and Robin Brown stars. A family ladies bought a $4 million house in Flagstaff, Arizona after listing their house for sale in August, regardless, in touch, can basically confirm that the case is untrue. In September, a virtual entertainment post suggested that the 55-year-old earthy-colored family, primogenitor and his wife, according to Soap, Dirt, 45 were supposedly moving into a lavish 68324 court-based mansion with eight rooms, eight bathrooms, a huge curved garage with views of the San Francisco tops on September 16th. The house was distributed. Nevertheless, in touch, verified via online records that the residence was given to a family trust. That was disassociated from the earthy hues last month, long after Robin and Cody videotaped their own Flagstaff house in return. $4 in touch essentially gave information about August night. That's when the conversation began to circle raised in 2007. The 4476 Four Court Base House is situated on two sections of verdant property set. A side down behind transcending pines on a disconnected peak. According to the table, there are five rooms and four bathrooms in the couple's house. In the meantime, buyers can anticipate a two-fold roaster, a large refrigerator slash cooler, and a walk-in storm in the kitchen.
The main room is equipped with an extravagant rec center. Such like in suite, bathroom complete with a huge parallel. Head shower and raised in racking in the stroll and storeroom, a game, two clothing condominiums, and an all-inclusive carport are among the other facilities as of distribution, Cody and Robin's house has not been delivered. Why the support decided to divide up their house or where they want to relocate is unclear in 2018. The earthy colored family moved to Flagstaff from Las Vegas, and in 2019, Cody and Robin bought the house. For starters, it was also established that the Browns owe the mogul money on several parcels of Coyote Pass, which Cody bought in 2018 with the intention of selling it and designing different residences for his four women. Moreover, they have 18 children as of August 29th in touch, verified that there were no dynamic design grants available on Coyote Pass. Cody's last lady is Robin. Mary Earthy, Janelle Brown, and Christine Brown all left the unscripted TV star inside. After several instances, the 52-year-old Christine quickly made her breakup with Cody Public in November 2021. She then posted a declaration on Instagram that read after more than a few times together, Cody, and I've become piecemeal, and I've pursued the fragile choice to leave in touch. Basically confirmed that Janelle, 55, and Cody had separated in December 2022. Will continue to be areas of strength for one another's lives. Cody Brown navigates strained family dynamics amid plural marriage dissolution, says Shoshobiz. In the midst of his unraveling plural marriages, Cody Brown has expressed exhaustion over the conflicts surrounding his separations from Mary Brown, Janelle Brown, and Christine Brown. However, rebuilding connections with his children remains a sensitive issue. In the divorce, the ugly finger of blame has come out, Cody stated in an episode of Sister Wives. His children have accused him of neglecting their needs while growing up. Cody claims he was balancing the demands of his four wives. Cody shares 18 children with his former wives. Mary Brown, 53, is the mother of their only child, Leon. Janelle Brown, 55, has six children with him, while Christine Brown, 52, has six. Cody and his current wife, Robin Brown, 45, have two biological children and adopted Robin's three children from her previous marriage. As the Brown family navigates the aftermath of Cody's marital losses, some of Christine and Janelle's children have distanced themselves from their father. They're purposefully leaving me out of their lives to punish me for a crime I did not commit. Cody lamented to Robin during an episode E maintains that his only crime was not falling deeply in love with their mothers. Despite Cody's denials, some of his children have expressed doubts about his level of involvement in their lives. Cody's daughter, Maddie, claimed that he admitted to not loving her mother, Janelle. However, Cody clarified that he never uttered such words and accused gossip of dividing his family. Janelle has also raised concerns about how Cody and Robin handle their finances. She highlighted their lavish spending on home decor and trailers, while questioning the family's inability to pay off their Coyote Pass property. Cody defended his financial choices, stating that he used his funds to purchase vehicles and insurance for the children. Robin, on the other hand, attributed her financial discipline to lessons learned from her previous marriage. Despite Cody's efforts to mend fences, he acknowledges that rebuilding takes time and effort from both parties. I'm not going to reach out forever, he stated. I'm willing to make the effort, but somebody else is going to have to be on the other end of that and make some effort too. Sister Wives, Cody Brown storms up after heated exchange with Robin over not seeing his children the last of Cody Brown's four marriages is on shaky groan amid heightened tensions with his only remaining wife, Robin Brown. During Sunday's all-new episode of Sister Wives, Cody and Robin had a heated exchange before the cameras arrived to film, prompting the father of 18 to leave the couple's Flagstaff, Arizona home. 
Robin is extremely upset that I'm not reaching out more to my children, Cody explained in a confessional. I'm not gonna sit here and fight with you. Have a rift in our relationship caused by these people who have created the biggest rift in my life. I'm not doing that. So I just decided I need to take off Cody did later return to the house, where the pair attempted to talk their differences out, only for Robin to continue to insist that Cody reach out to the older children he shares with former wives Christine Brown, Janelle Brown, and Mary Brown. I'm not gonna do it with a rejection every single time, Cody said. I'm not abandoning my children. They have betrayed me. But they're kids, Robin retorted. No, they're adults, Cody shot back, later adding in a confessional. Some people think that parental-child relationships don't have to be reciprocal, but when they're adults, yes they do. The blow-up comes after years of tension between Cody, Robin, and the rest of the Brown family, including disagreements over Cody's COVID rules and accusations that Cody favored Robin over his other wives, prompting Christine to leave Cody in 2021, followed by Janelle in 2022 and Mary shortly after. Robin, who shared that her own biological father was not present for her throughout her childhood, stressed to her husband the importance of him being a present father to his big brood. I'm having a hard time not losing respect for you a little bit, Robin admitted. If I were him, I would be calling, emailing, texting, maybe showing up, flying out there, you know, whatever, she added in a confessional. Cody, meanwhile, said he had no intention of begging his children to speak to him. So I've spent a year here just lamenting the situation, Cody added of the dissolution of the Brown family. When I get over that, those children who are open to me will get my attention. That answer, however, wasn't good enough for Robin, who noted in a confessional that she thinks Cody needs to step up. I don't want to judge Cody, but at the same time, I don't think Cody should be accepting it. I think that Cody should be camping out on I don't try enough, I know that. I'm too hot-headed right now, Robin. All I'll do is more damage, Cody admitted. The pair ended their conversation with Robin pleading with Cody to promise her that he would continue to try, to which he begrudgingly agreed, okay, a little bit. Elsewhere in the episode, Cody's estranged wife, Janelle, shared similar concerns this time claiming that Cody not only has a strained relationship with his gaggle of kids, but his grandchildren too. Janelle pointed out that Cody has been largely absent for daughter Madison's children, Axel, 7, Evie, 5, and Josephine, 19 months, whom she shares with husband Caleb Brush. The only thing the kids are upset with is the way he has treated the family, the way he has completely ditched out, Janelle said in a confessional. And really, Maddie doesn't have any contact with them. She is very protective of her children. She continued, Cody has not been there since Evie was born, and Evie is three and a half. And she didn't just want him to drop in and be like, oh, I'm your grandpa, and then be like, what? Who is this guy? Cody, however, doesn't think he is to blame for his estranged relationship with his grandchildren. It's an unrealistic expectation for grandparents to be in their grandchildren's lives all the time. He said, noting Madison and her family live in North Carolina, especially if you move your children to an entirely different coast. Cody also accused Madison of creating further tension between himself and Janelle amid their separation. They're purposefully leaving me out of their lives to punish me for a crime I did not commit, he said. I am only guilty of not falling madly in love with their mothers. Well, Madison actually called Janelle saying, Dad said he didn't love you in touch weekly. Sister wives Cody Brown claims adult kids are responsible for estrangement, says he's not guilty. 18 minutes ago sister wives star Cody Brown reflected on his estranged relationships with his adult children, and he refused to take responsibility for their issues. Cody, 55, and his last remaining wife, Robin Brown, got into a heated argument during the Sunday, October 6, episode on the TLC show, which led him to drive away as cameras arrived to film I, 
was putting pressure on Cody to work on his relationships with his kids, and it triggered him and it upset him, Robin, 45, explained in a confessional about their fight. Meanwhile, Cody explained how his splits from former spiritual wives, Christine Brown, Janelle Brown, and Mary Brown, impacted his relationships with his older kids. What has happened is in the divorce, in the divorces, is the ugly finger of blame has come out. Dad, you were never at my house, the father of 18 said. I'm sorry, I had four wives. I was at your house though, because the other wife was complaining that I was at your house. Cody shares one child with Mary, 53, six children with Christine, 52, and he shared six children with Janelle, 55. His and Janelle's son, Robert Garrison Brown, died in March at the age of 25 after he committed suicide. While the episode was filmed before Garrison's death, he and Cody were notably estranged at the time of his passing. Once Cody calmed down, he and Robin met up to finish their conversation. I just don't know why you're not reaching out to them more. Robin told Cody, adding that his older kids were hurting. However, Cody claimed that some of his kids didn't want relationships with him, and pointed out that some of them avoided him during a recent family wedding. They're purposefully leaving me out of their lives to punish me for a crime I did not commit, he insisted. I am only guilty of not falling madly in love with their mothers. It's an unrealistic expectation for grandparents to be in their grandchildren's lives all the time, Cody who is close with his and Robin's five kids, continued in a confessional. Especially if you move your children to an entirely different coast. The businessman then brought up his relationship with his and Janelle's daughter, Madison Brown. Every time I talk to her, she spreads gossip about me to the rest of the family, Cody claimed. Our family was killed by gossip. Janelle also weighed in on Cody's claims about Madison, 28, in her own confessional, insisting that she didn't believe her ex's claims. Cody has this narrative about Madison where she's such the gossip, but he is as big of a gossip, she said. While Cody insisted his kids were in the wrong amid their estrangement, he ended his conversation with Robin on a hopeful note. I will work. I will reach out to, I will love those children who will allow me to do it, he said. And in time, maybe the rest of them will come back around. Sister wives Cody Brown says marriage to Robin has been hurt more than relationships with his kids Cody Brown's marriage to his only remaining wife, Robin Brown, is on unsteady ground. During the October 6 episode of Sister Wives, the couple have tense arguments both on and off camera about Cody's estranged relationship with his older children, whom he shares with exes Christine Brown, Janelle Brown, and Mary Brown. In the wake of the respective splits, Robin feels Cody should reach out more to his kids, but he is more concerned about his relationship with her. You know what, Robin, we've had such a struggle with this, Cody told his wife. I'd almost rather just take some time to get in a better place with you and me, because I've been in this place for a very, very long time. And it's hurt us more than it's hurt them. Thank you for saying that. I appreciate that, Robin admitted. It's good to hear. The father of 18 apologized to Robin, telling her, I'm not meaning for that to come out on you. My heart is broken. I'm sitting here with the person that I love the most in the world, and my heart's still broken. What do I do with that throughout the episode? Robin urged Cody to continue reaching out to his children to try to mend their fractured relationships. Cody finally admitted, I don't try enough, I know that. I'm too hot-headed right now, Robin. All I'll do is more damage Robin admitted to her husband that she's having a hard time not losing respect for him adding in a confessional that he needs to make more of an effort as a father. I don't want to judge Cody, but at the same time, I don't think Cody should be accepting it, she noted. I think that Cody should be camping out on their doorsteps and saying, hey, you're going to talk to me. Things only seem to escalate between the couple in the trailer for next week's episode, as Cody prays to save me and Robin, while Robin is filmed on the floor in tears.
Sister Wives star Robin Brown's biological father shares eerie similarities with Cody Brown FLHSTAFF, Averizo NA. Sister Wives season 19 star Robin Brown's biological father, Robert Mark, has never been involved in her life. The reality star was just nine years old when he divorced her mother, Alice Sullivan. While her mother remarried Paul Sullivan, who played a fatherly role and even attended Robin's wedding to Cody Brown, she still felt the void left by her biological dad. Robin tried to seek answers from his father for his absence in her life, but he responded with lame excuses. Despite having a supportive stepdad, Robin longed for her father's presence and found it hard to watch Cody replicate that distance with his own children. The TLC show viewers have definitely noted striking similarities between Robin's biological father and Cody, as both men were absent from their children's lives and failed to take accountability for their actions. Cody, like Robin's father, has chosen to distance himself from his kids in favor of another relationship, leaving a void that echoes Robin's own experiences. Sister Wives season 19 star Robin Brown doesn't want her husband, Cody Brown, to do with his kids what her stepdad did to her. She urges him to mend his fractured relationship with his children, encouraging him to reach out and reconnect with them. She longed for him to embrace the chance for reconciliation, but his unyielding attitude left her frustrated and concerned. Despite her encouragement and hopes for a brighter family dynamic, Cody's reluctance to mend his relationship with his kids only deepened the rift, making Robin question whether he truly understood the importance of these bonds. Robert Mark and Cody Brown aren't the only fathers to step away from their children. Robin Brown's childhood experiences echo in the lives of her own children. Her ex-husband, David Jessup, relinquished his parental rights to Dayton, Aurora, and Brianna following their divorce leaving them without any contact. In a poignant twist, Cody stepped in to adopt Robin's children, providing them with the father figure they desperately needed. While Robin hoped for a different outcome for her kids, the parallels between her past and their present weigh heavily on her heart, driving her desire for Cody to forge a meaningful connection with them. No more today. What are you thinking about this gossip today? Let us know in the comments and stay tuned by subscribing to our channel to get more updates like this. Thank you.